Hi everyone, welcome back to CSA Vlogs. I'm Jack, I'm the upcoming productions director for the 2021-2022 school year. I'm going into my second year of nursing. And just a random fact about me is I have a extra bone in my feet. Really weird, that's what the, do uh, the doctor said. I don't even know. Anyways, I'm gonna be taking you guys along with me for my day. Um, I'm actually not at home right now. I'm in Kingston on a trip with my friend. So hopefully we have some exciting things planned for you guys. So usually after I wake up, I basically just like get dressed and um, head to the washroom to start, you know, brushing my teeth, washing my face, etc. So recently I started doing, trying out some skincare products and somebody recommended Lumen to me. Um, it's like a men's skincare brand and it's really expensive so I just got the trial to try it out. So what I use today is the charcoal cleanser and then followed by the moisturizer moisturizing balm. Wow, I really can't talk. <laughs> yeah, uh, after that I kind of just put on some sunscreen because sun protection important. And that pretty much sums up my morning routine. Pretty simple. Yeah. I've done my skincare, I'm gonna move on to taming my hair. So I'm gonna try using a straightener for the first time because I've never done that before, but I've seen videos of people doing it. So we're gonna try. My friend's gonna help me. Her name's Charlotte. Say hi. Hi, <laughs> So let's do it. <laughs> I think you have to just twist it a lot. Yeah. So I'm just I not cooperating. So <laughs> yeah. I don't know. That was. End result, not too bad. Uh, you can see there's a bit of like, texture to it. Whereas before it was just like flat, so that was good, I guess. Uh, it looks a bit wonky, but you know what? We'll make it do work. I put some wax in it to help hold it, and I think it looks not too bad. So maybe we'll try again in the future. Good morning! Hello, welcome to this episode of CSA Vlogs. I'm Angela, I'm the VP events this year, and I am going into my third year at Western. I'm doing HVA1, and as you can tell right now, probably, this does not look like a London apartment. I'm in my hometown in Richmond Hill, except I will be moving to London tomorrow, which is very exciting. And it's also why my room is a mess, and I'm strategically showing you this area of it right now. But anyway, welcome to the vlog. I think you already saw my skincare routine over there and my cheeky fit change that hopefully you did edit it <laughs> to make look less awkward. But anyway, so as for today's schedule, I'm going to be doing a little light makeup over here. Then I'm going to the doctor to get a physical done because I may or may not be anemic. I have pictures of my arms when playing after playing a bit of volleyball with friends and it seriously looked like blueberry dipping dots just all over my arms from playing volleyball. So my mom got concerned about that so I am going to get a physical done and afterwards I may pick up a cheeky drink for myself and then get to packing because bright and early tomorrow I will be moving to London. And later in the evening is our night two of the CSA cab and director social. And you'll get to see a bunch of our other executives there, which I think will be cute. Yeah, so let's just get into the makeup a little bit. And if that intro looked a bit weird, it's because I am filming on the music stand. This is what we do for CSA vlogs. Uh, 
back from the grocery store. Now we're gonna eat. Let me show you guys what we got. We have some other stuff for lunch upstairs in a fridge, but we're having croissants, and then we have bananas, <laughs> and some raspberries. So we're eating good. We're headed towards the lake right now um, because we want to take a ferry to Wolf Island just to explore around. So hopefully it's free because it's supposed to be free and running. <laughs> Wish us luck. Exciting. We're on the lake right now, on the boat right now. So, yeah, we'll see you when we get to the island. It's a fish in the clouds. Flying elephant? Where? See the one there? It's like a horn, and then like with the arm, it's like flying. We're at Wolf Island now. We just took the shuttle to the little village on the island and now we're just going to a farmer's market here. So we're just gonna look around, hopefully find some goodies, maybe some good food to try. So I ended up buying a pack of chocolate chip cookies from the farmer's market because what can I say, I have a sweet tooth. <laughs> Hello everyone, I am back after getting my physical done. I got my blood drawn and the nurse told me that my veins were really tiny so she couldn't really find them and it's also important to like stay hydrated so they're easier to um, perceive. So now I'm going to go home. I ordered two drinks from Starbucks that we're going to go pick up together and I'll talk more about Starbucks. I guess we can talk about it now. Okay, let's start driving. All right, so now we're sitting in the drive-thru for Starbucks. I guess now's a good time to talk about my coffee addiction or my Starbucks addiction, which can be like my fun fact for this video. I was nearly getting a new drink from Starbucks every single day. And that was a humongous strain on not only my health, but also my wallet. For me, Starbucks was like partly a reward for studying and working hard, but also there was that like caffeine addiction aspect of that that I feel like people don't take too seriously. But I, I really, I mean, I probably still do have a real caffeine addiction. But regardless, now I've cut back a lot on the Starbucks, especially with my new Nespresso machine, which is so exciting for me. It's just like a, one of those like pod instant coffee things. But I like it so much because you can brew like espresso, but it's a bit of, a, uh, of an investment. But I do think if you're a coffee addict like me who's spending probably too much money on iced coffee all the time, Investing in an espresso or like a machine that's similar might be a very good idea for you. All right, pulling up to the drive through. The brown sugar oat shaken espresso. 
I think that's what it's called. It's such a mouthful. It is such a pain to order, which is why I like doing um, like the mobile order and then like picking up so I don't have to like awkwardly stumble over my words. But it is my favorite drink. If you guys are still drinking coffee with like normal milk, honestly, you're behind on the movement. Reese, oh my God. So we're on our way into another building. It's a gallery. We're gonna go see some art. got off the ferry, we're back on mainland Kingston and now we're planning to walk on Main Street and look at the street market uh, and we're just gonna look around see if there's anything interesting and after that we're probably just gonna get uh, head home have some lunch and we'll see what we do from there see you guys Uh, after a long day, I mean it's not even the end of the day, but we're tired. <laughs> we did a lot of walking. We had lunch, which was, it was pretty good. We had leftover pizza and some turkey sandwiches, which is pretty good. Um, now we're just chilling on her bed. We're probably going to edit some of her photos, the ones that she took at the ferry or on the island. And after, we're probably going to go out to walk on Queen's campus and finish the day off with dinner. So, we'll see you. Here is our lunch for today. <laughs> My mom made dumplings, some beef, and our Starbucks drinks. All right guys, lunch is over. That was very good. I'm very full now. It's 1.30. And currently, I am descaling my Nespresso machine. Here it is. Hello, now it's 3 p.m. After doing a bit of hacking and descaling my Nespresso, it is now time for a bit of afternoon Valorant. Feel free to add me, guys. I'm very not good, but you know what? I'll support you when you pop off. <laughs> So we decided to go have dinner now. It's around five o'clock, a little bit early, but we're hungry from walking all day. So we decided to go to Tommy's, it's a diner, and they have all day breakfast, lunch items, a bunch of different things. And I, what are you getting? A chicken Caesar wrap. Chicken Caesar wrap. I'm getting a chicken sandwich. It's supposed to be good. Um, I'm excited. I'm hungry, ready to eat. So we're back from dinner. It was really, really, really good. The fries was definitely one of the highlights. One of the best fries we've ever had, for sure. Yeah. Uh, and we also got fortune cookies, which is really awesome. So we're gonna open them and read our fortunes. Hopefully it's something good. It's always something good. Okay, let's see. Keep in touch with some of the arts. Some form of arts. Okay, mm -hmm. cool. <laughs> Mine is, if you think you can, you can. Hi everyone, so dinner's over, now it's about 8 p.m. And after packing and everything, I was kind of tired, so I didn't really want to talk and do an update. But here we are, in 30 minutes, uh, we're going to go to the CSA social. But before that, I think I'll be here at the piano for a little bit.
So we're ending the night with a movie. Uh, we're gonna watch Room because it's one of the only movies I downloaded. Hopefully it's good. Um, but I think I'm gonna sign off here because after this, we're just gonna head to bed. So I hope you guys enjoyed following me with uh, my trip to Kingston and just exploring the city. And make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe and comment and look forward to new episodes soon. See you guys later. for today it was a pleasure taking you along for the journey thank you guys so much for watching right now it's 12 a.m and i almost forgot to film an outro because the social was so much fun but i'm here now thank you guys make sure to like the video and subscribe to csa's channel to see more upcoming vlogs and stay tuned for what we have in the school year see you guys bye, -bye.